but in defense of politicians. <laughs> School, I had a friend whose stated ambition was to become the Prime Minister of Canada. One day he said something that was factually accurate and yet so false I could see reality and I could see the story he was telling and I had to turn my head to look from one to the other. And I said, liar. And he shook his head. Factually adequate. <laughs> and he shone with pride like the light of a star reflected in water. And his pride was rooted in his defense, which drew on the old adage about horses and water. He merely led me to the lie. He did not make me drink. <laughs> you know what they say about politicians. Politicians stand for things they believe voters will fall for. And politicians promise to build bridges where there is no river. And the problem with political jokes is that they get elected. <laughs> you know what they say about politicians. Politicians are mini black holes in color-coded ties and sweaters. <laughs> Walking around shooting sparks of inspiration at each other. Phasers set to shock. And the awful thing about politics is that what it teaches is the fragility of my own integrity. Because Sometimes I am guilty of thinking that my inclination to root for the person on the reality show who says I am not here to make friends is harmless. <laughs> and not the very same vulnerability as voting for the politician who only looks non-sociopathic in profile. <laughs> and when I want to complain about being silenced, I think of their words, their lower middle class and downwardly mobile words. <laughs> Lovely, lonely vessels. Lovely, lonely vessels. Birds. Lovely, lonely vessels, birds, hope, peace, freedom, bloodless, breathless, bloodless, breathless, like with given tra um, transplanted wings. Look at me, touch me, touch my face. No, touch your own face. Touch your own face and pretend it is my face. I am pretending mine is yours. Feel my sincerity. Politicians. Mm -hmm.